Hello friends and how are you all doing today? Which we need to evaluate the following. This is the fourth part. Let's quickly proceed with the solution. Here we will be writing down the values of sin 30, tan 45, cosec 60, sec 30, cos 60, cot 45. from the table that is known to us. Now let's proceed. We have sine 30 as 1 by root sorry 1 by 2 plus tan 45 as 1 minus cosec 60 as 2 by root 3. It is getting divided by sec 30 which is 2 root 3 plus cos 60 which is 1 by 2 plus cot 45 degree that is 1. Let's simplify taking 2 root 3 as the LCM. We are left with root 3 plus 2 root 3 minus 4 in the numerator. Here also 2 root 3 will be our LCM. We have 4 plus root 3 plus 2 root 3. Simplifying, we have root 3 plus 2 root 3 as 3 root 3 minus 4. It is getting divided by 3 root 3 plus 4. We will be rationalizing the denominator by the conjugate of 3 root 3 plus 4. That is 3 root 3 minus 4. Now here if you carefully observe we have 3 root 3 minus 4 into 3 root 3 minus 4 which will be 3 root 3 minus 4 the whole square and in the denominator we have a plus b getting multiplied by a minus b where a is 3 root 3 and b is 4 so here we will have a square that is 3 root 3 square minus b square which is 4 square. This is because a plus b into a minus b gives us a square minus b square. And we know that a minus b the whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab. Right. So we will be using this identity over here to solve it. We have a square plus b square minus 2 a into b upon where our a is 3 root 3 and b is 4 upon simplifying it we have 27 minus 16 now we have 27 plus 16 minus on simplifying we have 2 multiplied by 3 gives us 6 6 multiplied by 4 gives us 24 and we have root 3 along with it upon 27 minus 16 gives us 11. So we have the answer, the required answer now as 27 plus 16 gives us 43. We have minus 24 by root 3 with it upon 11 and this is the required answer to the fourth and final part. Have you understood the solution well? Do remember the identities that you learned in your previous classes? And have a very nice day ahead.